Hello, I'm Commissioner Woods at Emergency Roleplay Community. Um, it's quite early in the morning, none of the other guys are on, so I thought I would get a video in why the server is quiet. Uh, I first want to apologise for the hat that's a bit broken. Um, we're going to get that fixed. But I'm here at the um up at the I forgot what base this is now the road traffic police and commands base so I've got three of the vehicles currently just out um here uh, the Volvo CX90 the Land Rover and the Jaguar what is the head of the road traffic police and command teams um, this is a big boss's car this is the car he wanted because he likes to think he's a boy racer so we gave him this so um, yeah emergency roleplay community is recruiting uh, four members um, currently got quite a few members at the moment but we're always looking for more police officers so if you're interested about joining I will leave a link in the subscription below um, some of the members will watch this video and I can confirm to them now that I will be recording videos um, much to their annoyance um, but I will be starting to record I may release them to you, yeah, YouTube, I'm not too sure. I have, when you've watched this, I have just put up a video saying that I'm quitting YouTube. So, yeah, you may get a few videos from Community Games pop up, because I can now record. I hope the quality is okay. There is something wrong with my mic, so if it's fuzzy... Um, I need to probably get a new mic. I've had this one for just over a year now. So we're just going to take a drive up to um, Polito now. Uh, I'm going to show you how the handling is and what sort of driving standards we do with, like, within the community as well. And I'm going to talk a little bit more about the community as we go up. So we've been running this community for just over a year now. Um, my deputy and my assistant commissioner have done a, bl a blinding job at um, ensuring that everything's in place. Uh, we've got an integrated CAD. Um, so the CAD's all integrated into 5N. Just let me pull over. I'll show you the integration of the CAD system. So what you do is we sl press slash... Oh, not 999. 911. And there, that'll call the control room to tell them that... Oh, I was... I was looking at the box, I do apologise, um, that please stand by for an operator. So that'll, that'll, tell, that'll ring the control room with your name, uh, what's on the CAD, and tell them that a civilian's waiting for a call. You can also s type in slash panic, that tells the control room precisely where your location is. On both things within the community, with the CAD that will tell them where your location is so they can ping locate you to on the server. I'm working together to get a live map. These are just some of the vehicles that we just a few vehicles in game. We have over about 90 vehicle, uh, 100 vehicles within the game so it's quite a lot of vehicles um, in the game, I've what I have personally handpicked every single vehicle what's in this game. 
I've, I've, I'm also involved in doing the client pack as well. I make the client packs for the community. All these mods are public, so you can get them. We use public models from legitimate modders. Um, also, we also check the history of the vehicles to make sure they're not stolen or ripped, as in the modding community they like to use rip. We've got different scripts within the community in the in-game setting as well. So we've got scripts such as random fires will appear all over the map. We also have um, all the Metropolitan Police um, vehicles that we can possibly get that are outgoing at the moment. And we also have custom peds as well. We each and every rank has the rank insignia put on the um, heads and we we also we also have the I'm trying to remember we have so many scripts I can't remember we also have realistic I, uh, AI so if I turn my sirens on this person is going to stop I'm just going to show you the realistic AI thing because when they hear oncoming sirens they will pull over as well. So I'm just going to show you the script if I can. The big lorries don't move over unfortunately but the cars do pull over. So they do stop, they don't just keep on rolling. See if we can get a car to pull over. Nearly fell through the map. car should pull over, here you go. Not really pulled over enough, but they, they are pulling over and stopping. As you can see that's every single car. Change our tones once again, just trying to get them. Here you go, the car just pulled over. So you can see that, that the scrap uh, actually works. Here's that car just pulled right over there. So that that's a nice addition to this server. Um, I know that the members, the other members, have been um, liking that script of lately. We also um, have a British. Um, British businesses in, so such as Bank of Scotland, Premier Inn, IKEA, um, British gas stations, British flags, British police stations as well. So there is a big server that's got about 2,000 files in it. Um, on last count, I think it was just over uh, 2,000. 455 uh, modded files in the server. It's a massive, massive client pack as well. I've just parked half on the pavement. Um, so it's a massive, massive file as well. Just let the textures load in. So I'll show you, I'll show you some of the vehicles in the listings that we've got just so you can see for yourself how big this server actually is so on the left here we've got all of the ERT cars and um, then we have the 
we've got all of the road traffic command to the right we have two traffic bikes we have all of the uh, SO and CO19 at the bottom left we then have our unmarked vehicles that are going to grow dog section I'll show you both of the dog section vehicles retained divisions they're, they're your retained divisions um, vehicles you then have LFB that have about five vehicles in total and they're about to get a six uh, station officers car going into ambulance you have all these ambulances and then you have your British um, your Brit your uh, BTP vehicles so in your dog section um, now this first vehicle I actually found in a modded list by um, accident we have uh, the Ford Mondeo that's no longer available um, I just happened to find it by mistake so we have the Ford Mondeo uh, I think this was British Gamer that made this don't quote me on that we then have Leap 99's brand new uh, Ford Mondeo uh, converted from GTA 4 and we also have um, the Mercedes Sprint or dog unit vehicle van uh, and both deliveries going on to some of the other vehicles now we have the BMW X5 E70 vehicle and um, the here's the fire script just came up I don't think the half Battenberg is actually in I think that's a way of getting repaired we also have We also have the BMW Saloon Seg that's no longer available. Uh, I think this has got ELS set up. Yes, it has. So, yeah, this vehicle's no longer available. We also have radar. <laughs> Is this one going to spawn in? this is in we also have oh, we also have the 530D uh, Trojan vehicle the E60 uh, from Double Doppler Bleep 99's brand new F15 it does take a while the Land Rover um, Trojan vehicle the unmarked F15 and I don't think this one's actually in yet oh no there is that's another F15 so there 
are the firearms unit vehicles in traffic you've already seen some of them so we'll go from here we've got the Ford Mondeo um, non skinned at the moment but we are working on getting it skinned The BMW um, X5 e E70. My fav my favourite car, mostly of the fleet, the Ascidian games is um, Volvo V70. Another one of my favourite cars, uh, I don't actually know what one this is, uh, it's non-skinned at the moment but we're working on getting it skinned. The old faithful Mitsubishi Shogun. The traffic vehicle that you saw back at the base. Recently to the road traffic fleet. We have now got the uh, Land Rover Discovery in. That's off butter. We then have the BMW Saloon vehicle. What you would probably see me driving because I absolutely love the ELS set up on that. And that vehicle isn't in. So that does it for the traffic unit. So that's some, not all of the vehicles uh, we have in game. There's, there's loads, there's absolutely loads of them. I'm not going to show them all off in one video. Because uh, we would, I'll show you some of the ERT cars. Yeah, uh, seeing as I've just saw some room. So some of the ERT cars we have in. The Jaguar F Pace, if it will spawn in. It is in, just won't spawn in. Oh, yeah, oh. So the Jaguar F Pace, and just delete this. The 2017. Ford Focus. Quite an old 2009 uh, Vauxhall Astra. And I will just whip up the two vans. That's one. And the other one's probably going to blast. I don't know. So. This is a good part of our fleet vehicles um, as you can see, there is 
loads of vehicles in the game. Um, so yeah, if you are wanting to join a very realistic role playing clan uh, community, then I would say um, for the work that everyone's put in, this is about the most realistic that you're going to get. This could be you one day in this community driving all of these vehicles and getting the privilege of driving them all. So thank you very much for watching this video. I will do a showcase with all the videos um, in due course. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll leave a link down below to the um, website so you can register. And for now, and everyone at Emergency Roleplay Community, a very good bye for now.